Welcome to GKE Essentials, where we explore basics and useful tips for getting up and running with GKE. I'm Kaslyn Fields, a developer advocate here at Google Cloud, where I focus on Google Kubernetes Engine and open source Kubernetes. Kubernetes is designed to enable and manage apps at scale. But beyond the upfront challenge of running applications lies something on everyone's minds, security. Today, we're going to talk about how GKE integrates opinionated security tools to help you keep your systems more secure. The concepts we're going to talk about today fall under the umbrella of GKE security posture management. Security posture is a broad term that covers many security aspects of your system. It's critical that you understand and actively manage the security posture of your GKE clusters. To help you do this, we provide managed opinionated tooling. One of the main tools that we have is the new GKE Security Posture Management Dashboard. This dashboard is built into the Google Cloud Console and consolidates several tools, layers, and perspectives that relate to your GKE system security. In the dashboard, you'll notice a variety of information about the security posture of your clusters and workloads. The charts give you a quick look at security across your clusters, including things like the severity of security concerns across your clusters, the types of security concerns, and what proportion of your clusters and workloads are affected. The GKE Security Posture Dashboard gives you opinionated Kubernetes security built into GKE. It provides best practice actionable security guidance. The dashboard shows you results from multiple monitoring, analysis, and scanning technologies that are built into GKE. The dashboard provides visibility, so you can understand your overall security posture at a glance. And these tools and the dashboard are all included with GKE. The idea of these tools is to help simplify some of the challenges of Kubernetes security. Security is a constant, so these tools provide continuous scanning and assessment of your workload security over time. In addition to gathering insights about your current security posture, Google also provides actionable remediation advice and guidance. By the way, even though we're focusing on GKE here, the dashboard and GKE itself integrate with the broader Google Cloud security ecosystem. The tools under the umbrella of GKE security posture management perform a variety of activities to assess, monitor, and manage your security posture. This includes scanning container images for known vulnerabilities from multiple sources. When we find vulnerabilities, we also provide opinionated guidance around the severity of the vulnerability and steps that you can take to fix the issue. And it's not only vulnerabilities that we can surface and provide recommendations on. To avoid security issues due to misconfiguration, we can validate your workload manifests against industry standards. If we find potential concerns, the dashboard shows you remediation steps and advice. That all sounds like a lot to take in, but how GKE security posture management works can be broken down into these three steps. Observations are gathered from source data from workloads and clusters, analyze settings, images, configurations, and usage patterns. The data from these observed factors is assessed using numerous detection sources to find security concerns. Once assessed, GKE surfaces concerns via tools like the Security Posture Dashboard, alongside actionable recommendations. The GKE Security Posture Dashboard is just one component of the Google Cloud Container Security ecosystem. For example, binary authorization provides deploy time security controls that ensure only trusted container images are deployed onto GKE. GKE Security Posture secures clusters and workloads through detailed assessments, actionable remediation advice, and insights. Software Delivery Shield improves security posture at scale, automating build and artifact provenance, enforcing SDLC policies from a central control plane. And the Security Command Center provides a broader view, with cloud-wide evaluation of security and data attack surface, providing asset inventory and discovery, and identifying misconfigurations, vulnerabilities, and threats. All of these tools are part of how Google Cloud helps you better secure your GKE clusters and workloads. In this video, you learned about a variety of ways Google Cloud's ecosystem of security tools helps you manage the security posture of your GKE clusters. While these tools cover a wide area of security considerations, the GKE Security Posture Management Dashboard can help you better understand your Kubernetes security posture at a glance. With the concepts discussed in this video, we're confident you'll be on your way to building a GKE cluster that suits your needs. 
You can get started with GKE by visiting the Google Cloud Console and checking out the links below. And stay tuned for our next videos where we dive deeper into GKE topics.